Okay, after posting the video yesterday showing some of the new features on this uh, new version of Triptico, Amanda asked a question on the, the website, uh, so I thought it might be as easy just to uh, create another video um, to answer that question. She asked if it's possible to uh, uh, copy and paste from other sources other than spreadsheets, and you can, you can copy and paste from anywhere, a Word document or a, a note or a, a website or whatever. Uh, so I thought I'd show you that quickly, and she also asked about images, and how we add images to an activity. Um, so make a very simple activity just based on three sports. So I'll click to create, and it's just going to be a simple list. Um, okay, you only need three um, items. So there we go. So here are my items here. So I just copy these from this note, and then paste them into column one. So there we go. Uh, I could have used the import data and one thing I didn't mention yesterday as well as importing data you can also if you wanted to use this as a way of just adding data so if I wanted to add some more uh, sports then I could just type them in here um, and then click done and then they'll be added so again so it's not necessarily just for pasting you could use that for um, for actually typing things in if it's a little bit quicker than possibly going through this process uh, and in terms of adding an image, so we've got football, tennis, and golf. So I'll click on football. If I click to browse, I can browse to a folder uh, where I can see I've got my football image, and that's added there. The other way that I could do it for the tennis one, if I actually open that folder on my desktop, here it is, I can actually just drag the picture across. So I'll just drag it from the folder and drop it on there. So that's another easy, really easy way to add an image. Um, and the last way for the golf, the third thing that I can do, if I go to the website, I can actually copy and then paste the image. So there's three different ways. So either selecting the image that I want to use from a folder or dragging it directly from the folder or from the desktop straight onto the uh, Triptico app or by copying it and then pasting it in. So there we go, a very simple activity, uh, three sports, uh, I'll call it three sports, and then we can preview it. So I could open it, for example, with the flip selector, and then we can see that simple activity. Another thing, just while we've got the flip selector open, another thing that I've done, so you flip to the, or swipe to the left to show the next card, but you can also swipe the other way, and it works backwards and shows you any previous cards. So, so that might be quite a helpful feature as well. Uh, so you can go backwards and forwards. The cards are still random um, if you want them to be, but you can go backwards and forwards and uh, see different cards. Um, okay, so I hope that answers your question um, about copying and pasting uh, and adding images to a Triptico uh, activity. Thanks very much for uh, for posting. I really appreciate it. It's always nice to, to get feedback and questions. Um, if anybody else has anything they'd like to ask or any feedback, then please add it to the site or send me an email. Whatever. Thanks very much.